Sid Lamar here, owner and operator of the Washington Crawfish Company, uh, giving you the first update of the 2023 crawfish season. Um, got a lot of work to do, so dirty hummingbird behind me here is still uh, needs a lot of work. Get it in uh, ship shape for this next season, but just a little bit of what's going on. Um, we're going to plan on starting to fish, or I'm going to plan on starting to fish in uh, early June, mid-June, and then uh, try to start selling in July. Uh, we have some hot weather coming up, which is good. If anybody's following the weather, it is an El Nino year, which means for the Northwest, uh, some hot, drier weather. And for me, what I'm waiting for is the snow melt to get out of the mountains and through the river system um, till the rivers stabilize and the temperatures rise a little bit and that really makes for a lot better crawfish yields. Uh, learn time and time again um, going out early you just uh, frustrate yourself you lose a lot of time you lose a lot of money. Um, so July 4th is typically the uh, the magical go date on almost any year after July 4th things are ready to go I think we'll be able to start a little earlier this year for us, this season is starting uh, mainly with the Pasco boil. It's put on by the uh, Chamber of Commerce and the Bentz family. Uh, you can look it up, it's online. Um, they're looking at a pretty big order of about 2,000 pounds. So I uh, look forward to doing that again this year. So if you're looking for a Cajun style crawfish boil where you don't have to do any work, but just uh, pay and show up, uh, check that out and check out the things to visit in Pasco. Uh, still working with the Grambles this year. They're uh, moving off of Roosevelt and down into the Columbia. So hopefully they're they're doing good down there. And uh, what we're trying to do is get things dialed in finally this year for you know stable crawfish as a wild a wild caught commodity. Uh, it's pretty hard to get some stability in the supply chain. So the more people fishing um, and the more they're bringing in and consistent yields, uh, we can get stable crawfish so uh, if you haven't already uh, if you ha know when your boil is and hopefully it's after July uh, you can go on the website and pre-order um, pre-order gets you in at a lower price as soon as I start actually putting traps in the water the price is going to go up and it typically just trends up all season so get your pre-order dates in that also uh, gives you a spot on the calendar because uh, I try not to oversell what we think we can catch um, and yeah, looking forward to a good season. Thanks for all the uh, repeat customers that are coming back this year. Uh, hope to uh, see you again and, and provide crawfish for your boil.